Hispanic story back right here at ringside, and we are ready to go with our pro wrestling, the Power Hour is on the air. We are live from the studios of TV5, and hey, let me tell you, Dave, the power pro wrestling Randy Hills has made it known that he is definitely going to take uh, the possession, he's going to, uh, whatever he says, is going to go in power pro wrestling. Billy Joe Travis pulled some things out here last week, telling the referee he was warned about it, Fine $500 out of the pocket of Billy Joe. Here's what happened last week. Take a look. He made it long out, Billy. Man, come on, Billy. Trevor's got the good shot. He's already clocked on that thing once today. Now, twice. Not only the guitars, yeah. but also pushing referees. He was warned about it. He was told, don't do that. He did it. He's suspended from television. Suspended and fined $500 out of his pocket. Yeah. Rules will followed on Power Pro Wrestling. No doubt about it. I got tongue twisted earlier because I'm so excited about today. Oh, what a big day on Power Pro Wrestling. Oh, oh my God. Let me, what do you want, Brandon? I, I, you're not scheduled. You're not scheduled for this. We're just getting the show going and we're not going to stand out here and let you talk all day. I don't care if I'm not scheduled for you because I have something that I want to say and I'm going to say it. And the only way that you're going to stop me is by having me physically removed from this TV studio. And that, that can be arranged, as a matter of fact. You see, Dave? I came out here and I told the world I was going to tell the truth about Randy Hale. I said I was going to expose Randy Hale for the snake that he is, and I did just that. But Randy Hale has me surprised. He's an even bigger snake than I thought because he has suspended and fined Billy Travis. Yeah, because he doesn't follow the rules, but he was warned, and he is suspended. Billy Joe is one of the nicest guys you'll ever want to meet. He is a true gentleman. He's a family man. He's a great wrestler, and as you all know, he's a great singer. But Billy Joe Travis, he will be back here next week, and everybody's going to pay. Last thing I want to talk about. I know that Jerry Waller and Bill Dundee are sitting in the dressing room, and they're laughing. They're patting each other on the back. They're probably in the control room with Randy Hill's laughing right now because Billy Joe's not going to be here. But let me tell you, boys, the match is going to happen because Billy and he's got a mystery partner for Paul Diamond, and that's going to play the legend of Power Pro Wrestling. Last thing I want to say. Oh, that was it. That was it. This is it. Randy Hell, I promise you and I vow to say, I will destroy Power Pro Wrestling. Brick by brick, the foundation will crumble, and standing at the rebel will be Randy Hell, a female All right. Here. 
Well, he's opening uh, the ropes here for it, Dave, and I see. Jekyllin steps in, referee Aubrey Wayne calls for the bell. Here we go, it's the opener on Power Pro Wrestling. Oh, looking forward to it. Uh -huh. Hey, don't forget, too, we got uh, Mo, who is now, he, he doesn't want to be known as Mo anymore. He's yeah. probably going to be upset I said that. B.J. Awesome. Yeah. B.J. Awesome coming out here a little bit later on. Boy, he was trouble last week. Oh, yeah. Here we're going to get the Spellbinder. And, of course, that big main event. Brandon Baxter was talking about it. Lawler and John D. are teamed. We're going against Paul Diamond and a mystery partner. Yes, sir. And as we stated earlier, we've got that eight-man elimination tag match. Boy, I don't know if we've ever seen that on television. Well, you're going to see it today. And it's an elimination tag, eight-man, coming up yep. on Power Pro. Look at this. Elimination single match, every man for himself in that one. Uh, we and, and it's not over a top rope uh, type thing. It's, uh, it's it's regular rules as far as pins and what have you. Yeah, disqualification uh, for elimination. Yeah, disqualification. All those things will apply. So it's not an anything goes match. Uh, it could be very interesting to see with eight of them in there and every one of them vying to be the last standing to uh, challenge the champion Kid Wicked. Whipped into the rope. Jacqueline comes out of there swinging hard. On Lumberjack Paula Bunyan. Hey, Power Bowl's in Jonesboro, Arkansas tonight. Tickets are on sale right now at the wow. Front Page Cafe. Make your plans to be out there tonight. What, what is the matter? Well, that story, I don't mean to come out here and interrupt, but like I said, I have done everything I can to get Randy Hill to talk to me. And now we've got a so called ladies' night out here. And I don't know what the problem is. I have talked to Jackie. I know she's a friend of Randy Hill. We don't have any problem with each other. I mean, I came out here. I'm in good shape. I can wrestle. I can do everything that this job needs to do. I have charisma. I mean, I don't know what the problem is. Excuse me, Sam. You know, you know what? But nobody really cares. Miss Jackie is the greatest wrestler in the world, the greatest woman wrestler, and nobody cares. Nobody cares. Nobody you need a job. Here. You don't need a job. Here last week. She's got the best job. She's got the best job. So don't you get over here. Because you saw Tony Falk don't mean you can do anything. And Miss Jackie is the greatest woman wrestler alive today. Nobody's saying that Jack Wynn is not a good wrestler. What we're saying here, if I talk to her, I talk to everybody here. I can wrestle, and I'll have a job on this TV station. Nobody can do it. What you need to do is just take yourself right on out of here. Because we're not here talking. I don't think so. You well, don't tell me. I'm going to tell you. Oh. We've got a big match going on over the ring here. We're having so much trouble getting this match in here. And the cover one, two, three. Jackie gets the victory. What a move from Jacqueline. I tell you what, you say, look, I can solve all your problems right now. You need to be at home taking care of your kids and cleaning up that house. Hey, come on, you guys. the victory in the match over Paul Bunyan and now it's something to look out here comes Tony Falk jumping up on the ring apron oh, oh. Jackie. she Jackie. stopped the ring whoa Jackie stopped Tony Falk shoves Derek King away and Samantha and Miss Jacqueline boy they're both taking care of things oh. there's more to come on the power hour no she go away we're just getting started
without a roadside assistant. One and a half million in used inventory. That's the Chuck Cutton Advantage. Chuck Cutton Van Wall is closing out 1997. We have 16 custom vans at unbelievable low prices. Save up to $8,000. Choose from Explore, Mark III, and Regency. Chuck Cutton Van Wall has the selection you want at the price you want to pay. Hurry in now before the 97s are gone. Entire Mid South is talking about. Our next will join Armory on the campus of Arkansas State University. See Jerry, the King Lawler, return to Jonesboro. He'll also see superstar Bill Dundee, 260 Brian Christopher, Irv O, Chucky, the Young Gun, and more. Advance tickets on sale now at the Front Page Cafe. Six big matches tonight in Jonesboro at the Arkansas State University National Guard. Friday night, May 22nd, PBW is coming to Cos, Mississippi. Friday night, May 29th, Brinkley, Arkansas. And on Saturday, May 30th, the stars of Power Pro Wrestling return to Kevin, Missouri. Mark your calendar. Tell your friends. Power Pro Wrestling is coming to a city near you. Hey, don't miss it when it comes ah. to your town. Last week in Jonesboro, I know the weather was terrible in Jonesboro, yeah. Arkansas last Saturday night. It's going to be great there tonight. Great. Take your right. fans. Go on out. See Power Pro Wrestling. Great. You won't regret it in Jonesboro tonight. <laughs> no doubt about it. Hey, we got a big uh, eight. Man, elimination coming up with the winner. Take it on Kid Wicked for that Young Gun Championship. He won that beautiful trophy on last week. Yeah. Take a look at what happened in all of that. Uh, this oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. David, I think he, I think he broke my nose. Sorry, Jack. I disrespected you last week. You're more man than I thought you were. In the prison. Good wicked. Beaming as though he's proclaiming uh, Derek as the champion. And uh, he's getting heading into the ring. This is the uh, finish of the champion. Oh, 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 Battle Royal. Yeah. Look at this. And I thought that that was it right there. That uh, that Derek King uh, was going to be declared the winner by Kid Wicked. Yeah. But look what happened. Oh, uh, boy. Yeah. Gets behind him. Gets the neck breaker. And Kid Wicked made the cover. And Kid Wicked is the one that walked out with his trophy. But he did it by devious means. Which to expect. Oh, yeah, no doubt about it. Well, now we've got the eight-man elimination that's coming up next here on the Power Hour of Power Pro Wrestling. Oh, this is going to be exciting. I promise you, with the capital E here today, we've got big action, including for the first time on Power Pro Day, the team of Bill Superstar Sandy, Jerry the King Lawler. They are here as partners today, no doubt about it. This man right here should be a good one, let me tell you, because the winner of the last man standing in this match gets an immediate championship match for the Young Gun Trophy against Kid Wicked here today. Here comes the James, James. Bobby Braun. Yeah, along with the play, Ashley Hudson. Yeah. In the ring, you got Slow, Reality, the Yellow Jack. Everybody's in the ring. Top rope there, yeah. Referee Bill Rush right in the middle. He's got his hands full today with his eight-man action today. <laughs> eight-man elimination. Everybody's for themselves as uh, either a pin or disqualification eliminates you from this eight-man elimination match. Starting out, Derek King and Bobby Brown. And, you know, Corey, I think you touched on it a little bit earlier. I don't ever recall one of these on television. Uh, seen it in arenas, but uh, to have an elimination match, not battle royal rules now. This is an elimination match. What is going to face Kid Wicked later today for that Young Gun Championship? Nice hip oh. toss from Bobby Bronson and again, he takes Derek King down. King missed the personality. Over the top rope. Oh. Yeah. Man. <laughs> Smacked him down on the floor. Derek King can't be feeling too good right now. Derek King sent word before the match that he was dedicating this victory, he was claiming, to Jackson. Yeah. He was going to dedicate it to Jackson. Mm. He won this elimination match. Well, it remains to be seen if he wins it here. And whether or not Jackie's impressed remains to be seen, too. That's true. Mr. Burton announced he's got his hands full. Blaze teams up with Bobby Braun. Big backflip. And Derek King goes down. Blaze working away now. That's Bert, Mr. Burton Alex is there. But of course, last week, oh, William Blaze is way back there now. Last week, he came out dressed as the King. Week before, Double J. And he's got John 
Michaels out there. I guess the heart on the tights, I guess. Yeah. Uh, Jackie, uh, you know, his heart is with her, I guess. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. Reality, he's let in out to play. Play got out of his way. Whips him into that corner. Follows him with the elbow. And Blake staggers out of there. Reality staggers out of there from that nice move from Blake. Oh, he hangs on to the rope. Cross down on this big guy. Boy, he comes in. Two. Is that two? Two count. Now two the referee count. says a two count. So Blake continues into the match. Yeah, Reality backs yeah. him up with him in. He comes in, Dave, at about 325 pounds. I was going to say, this He's Reality is a... There's a count of two, three. This time he got him. Boy, he power slammed him down, and that's a freak down. This, uh, this, this reality reminds me of a rhinoceros. <laughs> he's big, he just charges straight ahead. Oh, and geez. anything in his path will look out. Look at this, right into the road. Nice drop kick from Bobby Bronze, and uh, Bronze going after this big reality. Bags him up, staggers the big guy, catches him as he comes off of there. He's got him down, one count, two. And he lifts the shoulder up. Eight-man elimination, everybody for themselves. As they eliminate it, they leave the area, and it comes down to one man, and the winner of this eight-man elimination will face Kid Wicked. And Bear Hogg going to slam down to the mat. Bobby Braun's on the mat, and reality's holding for a three count. No, he doesn't. I tell you what, there's some kind of talent in this division. This Bobby Braun, mm -hmm. man, he has looked good every week we've seen him. In the weeks and months ahead, I really look forward to seeing Herrings in this young gun division. Yeah, I do too. There's been a lot of talk around now in the Mid-South about it. Everywhere I go, everybody says, oh, I love that young gun division. Yeah. Oh, oh over the top. Yeah. Oh. He's disqualified. Okay. Yeah. Over the Rubbery top. Bill Lawrence caught him. Reality is out of here. That's exactly right. He's disqualified. Because remember, this is not an over-the-top rope elimination. Over-the-top rope it disqualifies the man who threw him over the top rope. So reality is gone. But now Bobby Braun has been picked up by reality. He's thrown into the ring post. Oh, my goodness. Hey, Dave, did we hear Brandon Baxter say earlier that Paul Diamond's got a mystery partner? A mystery up? partner. And who knows who that might be, uh, considering uh, Brandon Baxter, for one thing, and Billy Joe Travis for another. That's right. Billy Joe Travis suspended after all of that stuff he pulled out here last week, and it's been fined. $500. Big super kick. Two count. Three. And there goes Bobby Bronze. He's eliminated. We need to get a commercial break in. Let's do that right now as the Young Guns elimination match will continue. These are the cards. That is the heat. This is the blade. Get 1.9% financing or $1,500. Cash back on Escort or ZX2 at your local Ford dealer. One nine and small monthly payments or $1,500 cash back when you lease or buy. These are the cards. That is the deal. This is the place. Escort, ZX2. One nine or $1,500 cash. Hurry, all three and soon. That's all. You can beat the heat this summer and relax in your very own pool or spa and save hundreds during the factory sponsored surplus sale at Watson. Get factory surplus savings on above ground pools and spas with gazebos from Home and Rome, Sunmaster, and Cal Spas. There are 97 models, overruns, and distressed merchandise, all priced at or below wholesale. And factory reps will be competing for your business at any price. Plus, get special financing too. This factory sponsored surplus sale is being conducted only at Watson, Thursday through Monday. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. Don't miss the advanced auto parts private and spring sale with hundreds of items on sale live. Pascal Convention Weight Motor Oil, 99 cents a quart, limit one K. Gram or pure oil, oil filter, two for five dollars. I guess it's going to take 20 wins. Advanced auto parts. The new game in town. And tell them fix it. Advanced auto parts. The best part is our people. When severe weather threatens the Mid-South, you never have to work. With Pinpoint Doppler Radar from Action News 5. It's the most powerful tool that any television station has ever had. Pinpoint Doppler Radar uses a high-resolution digital beam. Look inside the storm and track changing weather conditions covering Tennessee, Mississippi, Arkansas, and the blue wheel of Missouri. We stick in this enormous power out of the laboratory and into your living room. Early warning and pinpoint accuracy. Pinpoint Doppler Radar. Doppler radar. Weather coverage you can count on. Five men left. 
Then the elimination match here. We'll start that out with eight. Yellow Jacket has Lance Jade on the mat right now. Jade back up on his feet. Oh, Yellow Jacket throws it into the corner, makes the tag on slow. Over on the other side of the ring, Ashley Hudson looks for a tag from Lance Jade. Lance in trouble right now, too, boy. They've been double teaming on him. Yellow Jacket and the slow. Understand, Dave, a major announcement regarding the future of Power Pro Wrestling is coming May the 30th. Randy Hales has told us huge announcement coming. But he hasn't told us much else. He hasn't told us nothing else. <laughs> major <laughs> announcement. I thought maybe you knew what I did. I hope it's, uh, well, I know with Randy it's going to be something big. So be sure to stay tuned to the Power Hour every week so you'll know what's going on with Power Pro Wrestling. A big announcement comes on May 30th. By the way, next week, Next week we're going to be on. We're going. Oh, he got uh, he got Swole. Swole's eliminated. Lance yeah. Jade continues. Swole's out, and we're down to four. Next week we're on again at our regular time, at 11 o'clock. Yes, sir. Be sure to join us. Tell all your friends. Hey, this is the day today you want to tell all your friends. Pick up your phone and call them and tell them, hey, Power Pro Wrestling is on because we've got a huge lineup today. The first time ever teaming up on Power Pro. Jerry the King Lawler, Phil Superstar Dundee, still waiting to see who the big mystery man is here today as well, Dave. I think we would agree. You can't tell enough people about Power Pro Wrestling. No. Tell everybody you think of. Power Pro Wrestling on the air. 11 o'clock Saturday on TV 5 and it's live. Hey, Lance Jade working away on the Yellow Jacket. Let's read Joe Rush. Get in the mind of that. Oh, Yellow Jacket. Yellow Jacket looking his tight. Going in his, going in his uh, beehive there, I guess. The yellow jacket. He's got the boot. Uh, he loaded up that mask. Look at that. One, two, two count. Three three count. Yeah, yellow jacket with something in that mask. Yeah, I don't know what he did, but he's got Lance Jade's out of here. So as Ashley Hudson steps in, Hudson, the yellow jacket, and Mr. Personality, Derek King. Say what? The way yellow jacket's been going, he might be a, an upset winner in my mind anyway. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at this yellow jacket. Two places. Hudson down in the middle of the ring. Now he's up on the top rope. Flies off of that thing. Look at that. They caught it. Ashley wow. just sort of uh, sort of stumbled in the wrong place there. Only a two count. And I thought Hudson was gone, but he's still in there. Look at the yellow jacket. Swing away at Ashley Hudson. Hudson reverses and whips him in. Oh, Whoa. yeah. Great move. move. Yeah. Two count. Three yeah. count. Yellow jacket. Well, no upset for the yellow jacket. He's out of here. Uh-oh. Now it's Derek King, Mr. Personalities, Ashley Hudson. They're the last two. Whoever is the next eliminated, that means the one remaining, gets the championship match coming up a little bit later on. Mr. Personality, Derek King, he was uh, left in the 14-man battle royal last week. Yeah, it was he and uh, Kid Wicked uh, for the championship last week. They were the last two. Could we have a rematch coming up here? We'll see as we go along. Ooh. Ashley Hudson with a big drop on the mat. A hit as, uh, oh my goodness, Derek King had a cover but couldn't hold him. Did you see the way Ashley just threw him off uh, there? He threw him about three feet in the air to break that cover. Ashley Hudson puts into the ropes by Mr. Personality, Derek King. Hudson sets him up. Look at this. He's got it. Two flexes and down with the mat, and there's a cover oh, by Ashley Hudson. One, two, oh, only a two count. I thought that was going to do it. I did, too. But Jerry King, Mr. Personality, who dedicated this match to Jackie, he says. Oh, yeah. Come on. Whoa, whoa. Moved out of the way. That's a mistake by Ashley Hudson. What is this? King going for that towel, which was rolled up over to go. He's got some kind of power thing. He's dumping it into his hand. He's got a hand full of it. Here's Hudson. Oh, 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 it went at Derek King's face. Four, maybe yet. One, two. Ashley Hudson is the winner of the elimination match. He is the one who's going to be going for the championship. The man from down under, Ashley Hudson. Victorious in a very difficult match here today. Yeah, I want to get a word from Ashley. He wrestles out of Melbourne, Australia. Hudson's going to get a shot at the Young Gun Championship against Kid Wicked. Hey, congratulations. Good looking victory. Got a big match coming up today, Ashley. Thank you very much. I just like to tell everybody today, Miss Bay. Uh, as everybody knows, I made a lifelong commitment to this professional wrestling. I left my home in Australia. Came down here to establish myself as a professional wrestler. 
This is my big opportunity. So you came today for you. Congratulations, guys. Oh, hit your skin, Wicked. Hey, come on. <laughs> you all are going to have a match right here now. Nobody cares where you came from, and nobody cares where you're going. My advice for you is to forfeit this match and save your family and get your tail back to Australia before I get wicked on you. Well, so what you're saying? Hey, Chief Wicked, so what you're saying is you want me not to show up, not to take the match? You know another thing coming, mate. I've come a long way for this. I've traveled halfway around the world for this opportunity, and you aren't taking that from me. Well, I don't blame you, Ashley. Congratulations on your victory. You guys are going to hook up here a little bit later on. Coming up, the Young Gun Championship with Ashley Hudson and Kid Wicked. Hey, come on! What is this? The more power. Uh, Kid Wicked just jumped on Ashley Hudson. This is not this is not the scheduled match either, today. No, of course not. This is supposed to be just come a... Come on! Well, I actually say a word about the opportunity to go for the championship and Kid Wicked. Uh, it's obvious what he's trying to do is trying to hurt Hudson so Hudson can't go against it in the match. Come on! Take that stuff out of here! Uh, we're, we'll be back. We're, we're going to see if we can get the real match going here in just a moment. I need a new car, but my bank balance is zero. That's all you need to own a new car at Mount Malai Auto Marquia. Put zero dollars down and drive home in a new car today. You're telling me I don't need a down payment or a trade to get a new car? Not at Mount Malai Auto Marquia. You put down nothing, nada, zero, zero, and own a new car today. That sounds too good to be true. Come to Mount Malai Marquia and let us make you a believer. You can own a new car for zero dollars down at Mount Malai Auto Marquia. Put zero down and get your car today. You might think this start could cause serious engine damage. But surprisingly, this cold engine start could cause more damage. That's why Exxon Superflow motor oil races to protect vital engine parts right from the start, when significant engine damage can occur. For these racing teams, there is only one winning formula. Exxon Superflow. Fashion known the world over, S&K brings you Italy. In suits crafted from Super 100's Italian fabric. By the finest European tailors. At S&K, they're half what you'd expect to pay at two for under $350. And these beautiful Italian silk and wool sports coats are under $130. So now for the most renowned collections in menswear, you can just come to S&K. You better look stupid. Now that's Italian. Five locations. Thomas and Wolfgate, Eastgate Mall, Germantown, Boston, Dickory Hill, and Jackson. When it comes to near you, love to have you right here in the studios of TV5 for Power Pro Wrestling. Tonight, Jones for Arkansas at the National Golf Army on the campus of Arkansas State University. And, yeah, that's Kid Wicked's music. Torrance, Mississippi, American Legion building Friday night in Torrance, Mississippi. Be there when it comes near you. Young Gun champion Kid Wicked taking his way to the ring. And uh, Kid Wicked, that's the way he just pulled out here. Today. I don't know if Hudson's going to be able to wrestle or not after uh, Kid Wicked jumped him, threw Potter in his face, and nailed it from behind back here. Yeah. During the interview, I don't see Hudson headed this way. Kid Wicked is celebrating already. I don't either. Wicked's got that beautiful young gun uh -oh. trophy. Here comes Ashley Hudson out with help. Yeah, he's got help. He's got the both referees. I'll be playing Bill Rush. Is he going to be able to the referees are saying that, uh, that Ashley doesn't need to go on with this thing. This is my golden opportunity. I've traveled half around the world for this. And no one's taking it from me tonight. I understand, Ashley, but uh, it's the referee's settled. I've got a story settled down in that ring, and no one's got to stop me. Well, Ashley Hutch is not taking advice of anyone, Dave. Well, I understand Ashley's position there. Yeah, I can't do it. But I'm not sure it's a wise move to get in there against Kid Wicked. It's uh, tedious anyway. Yeah, that's the uh, sonic just pull. But, you know, to look at it from Ashley's viewpoint, he won a match to get to this point here today. And he doesn't know if he'll be back to this point any time in the near future. So with the, uh, uh, with all the prestige and, and the cash, let's face it, that goes with the championship, Ashley Hudson does not want to miss the opportunity if there's any chance he can defeat Kid Wicked and take the championship trophy.
Chelsea off. Count it. Oh, only two. I thought maybe Kid Wicked had a very short match here. Kid uh, Wicked has, yeah, he's been very successful, Tony Williams, because he changed his name to Kid Wicked. But his actions, boy, I can speak louder than words. And the way he's been acting the last few weeks, Dave, is just absolutely uncalled for. Well, I like Tony Williams a lot better than I like Kid Wicked. Yeah. I guess. Hudson as he came staggering out of that corner. One, two, and Hudson lifts the shoulder. Gets out of that thing. Hey, don't forget our big main event coming up here today. Lawler and Dundee team together as a tag team. Billy Lauren against Paul Diamond and some mystery partner that Brandon Baxter and Billy Jeff Travis have come up with. Yeah. Who knows who might come walking through the curtain. We'll find out together here in just a few minutes. Don't go away. Our pro wrestling continues on the power hour. Oh, yeah, and Power Pro Wrestling is in Jonesboro tonight. Jonesboro, boy, I keep talking about that because Jonesboro has always been traditionally a great city for wrestling. Well, we're bringing it back to Jonesboro, Arkansas tonight on the campus of ASU. Make it a point to get down there Ooh. and see the action. Boy, Tony, get wicked from running in there and missed that time. Yeah, he made a mistake. Ashley yeah. Hudson comes after him. Hudson is trying to take advantage of the mistake. That's Ooh. all right. About the only way you're going to be able to defeat a kid. Wicked count of one, two, and he kicks out. Ashley Hudson whips him into the ropes. Nice drop kick. Boy, Hudson's got it going here now. One, two, and Kid Wicked kicks out. Young Guns Championship is on the line. This beautiful Young Guns trophy that's over here at our desk yet. Is that stake here today? In this battle. He stops Kid Wicked.
Folks at Hillborn, we're here to help injured people, and we know how. Hi, this is Tom Buster Giacomo. Sky 5 Over Barbecue is brought to you by Gossett Motors. You will need to bring your walking shoes. It's about a two-and-a-half-mile round-trip walk through everything that's going on. If you have three things to look at, the first thing you need to see is the world's largest Weber grill. See the Budweiser exhibit that's on display up by the main stage, and then go by and look at each of the booths for the intensity of the cook. They are competing for $40,000 in championship money and the trophy. From Sky 5, Forgotten Motors, this is Tom Preston Giacomo. Having a great time. Wish you were here. The Power Hour is back on the air. Power for wrestling. We've got a huge tag team action coming up here today with the mystery of being no longer a mystery. Brendan Baxter bringing out Master B. Fine. Oh, we need it. And now, here is B.J. Awesome. He says no more. Sir Mo, it's B.J. Awesome now. That's right, Corey Macklin. As long as you don't say the M word, me and you can get along. Huh. I'm not going to let you people get under my skin today. I got a few things I want to say. Randy Hales, you didn't want to call me back. So last week I decided I'd come out here on my own, take care of a little bit of business. That's not the way to do it. Hey, 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 you don't interrupt me. You don't interrupt me. Yeah. As I look around the studio, I don't see Brian Christopher nowhere here today. Because I took care of Brian Christopher. And now this week, y'all sitting out here going, boys who are friends to spell fine. Well, you come on out here. And here he is. The Spellbinder. You asked for him, BJ Austin. And you're going to get him here on Power Pro Wrestling. Oh, yeah.
we'll go to BJ Awesome over the bell binder. We still got a man event to go. We still got a big one, boy. I'm looking forward to it coming up on the Power Hour. Stay with us. Hey, Power Hour is brought to you by Power Hour Sports Memphis. Memphis, you'd be better get ready to rock. The bad boys are gonna ride. WMC TV5, the Mid-South's main channel for 50 years. Delivering the best in news and entertainment then and now. The Lone Ranger rides again. Celebrating 50 years of friendship. WMC TV5 and you. You can see the heat this summer and save hundreds during the factory sponsor surplus sale. But hurry, the surplus sale is being conducted only at Watson Thursday through Monday. They're so hot. I am the perfect Barbie. 34, 44, 35. No one will touch them. You can't get a date. The guys are afraid. I leave them speechless. Jenny Jones, Monday at 3 on WNC TV 5. They're unlisted and untested by the FDA. But some women swear by them. Can you take a pill to make your breast bigger? Is surgery the only answer? Or is this some get rich quick scheme that could hurt you? It's an Action News 5 Health Pass exclusive. Monday at 6 on Action News 5. Coverage you can count on. It's the tour the entire Mid-South is talking about. Power Pro Wrestling, coming to a city near you. Tonight, Jonesboro, Arkansas, at the National Guard Armory on the campus of Arkansas State University. See Jerry the King Lawler return to Jonesboro. You'll also see superstar Bill Dundee, 260 Brian Christopher, Ermo, Chucky, the Young Gun, and more. Advanced tickets on sale now at the Front Page Cafe. Six big matches tonight. In Jonesboro at the Arkansas State University National Guard. Friday night, May 22nd, TPW is coming to Corinth, Mississippi. Friday night, May 29th, Brinkley, Arkansas. And on Saturday, May 30th, the stars of Power Pro Wrestling return to Kenner, Missouri. Mark your calendar. Tell your friends. Power Pro Wrestling is coming to a city near you. Be there, another like live Power Pro Wrestling when it comes to your town. We're going to have it for you right here at the bridge in just a moment. Just a moment. Here they come right here. The superstar leading the way. Bill, welcome. All right, it's good to be here next Friday night. I'm going to be the American Legion in Building, Columbus, Mississippi. All right. Samantha's going to be there, and Billy Joe Travis, you're going to be in Jonesboro at night, and I'm going to whoop up on you. That's right. Billy Joe's suspended from television, but he will be in, uh, in Jonesboro and other bookings here tonight. Okay, I want to get a few things out of the way, a few things cleared up. First of all, the last time anybody saw me and Bill Dundee on Power Pro Wrestling, we were tied it up right in the middle of the ring, and Stacy even got involved. And I want to say this right now. I'm much happier being your partner than I am fighting against you, Bill. So for today, I want to apologize for that little situation. Stacy wants to apologize, right? Oh, okay. okay. Hey, all right. All right. Liberty Land. 
events from 1 to 3 this afternoon. And then tonight, right after the Liberty event, we're going to head right over to Jonesboro. We're going to kick some butts over in Jonesboro, Arkansas. But right now, we're going to do it right here in this race. So get them out here. Have you seen the mystery parker? Have you seen the mystery parker? Did you see that? That ain't the mystery parker. The guy raised the roof.
buyers buy low, so you buy low every day. And of course, same day alterations and a complete line of accessories. Downtown, Queen of Union and Bay and Bay, back the outside world. What's the Chuck Hutton advantage? Certified pre-owned vehicles at Chuck Hutton with a 3,000-mile, three-month limited warranty, plus 24-hour roadside assistance. One and a half million is used in Missouri. That's the Chuck Hutton advantage. Chuck Hutton Van World is closing out 1997. We have 16 custom vans at unbelievable low prices. Save up to $8,000. Choose from Explore, Mark Free, and Regency. Chuck Hutton Van Wall has the selection you want at the price you want to pay. Hurry in now before the 97s are gone. The action continues. That is Master B5 today, formerly known as Reggie B5. He's in there against Bill Dundee. It's Waller Dundee against Master B5 and Paul Diamond. Master B with the superstar in, and Dundee rolls! He gets that, and Master B tangled up. He did a big T over there, the turnbuckle.
summer and relax to your very own pool or spa and save hundreds during the factory sponsored surplus show. At Watson, get factory surplus savings on above ground pools and 